Peck and Olo had a sleepover at Olo's house. Even though they stayed up late, they were both early risers and got up with the sun. What's for breakfast? Peck asked. Let's make something, Olo replied. They found a recipe for pancakes and another for French toast. Which one should we pick? asked Peck. The French toast looks fun, Olo said. Let's make that. What do we need to make it? Peck asked. Olo read the recipe. Please get some bread from the pantry, he replied, and I'll get fresh eggs and milk from the fridge. They whisked the ingredients together as fast as they could. Finally, the mixture was nice and frothy. What's next? asked Peck. Next, we dip the bread in, Olo responded, and flip it to cover both sides. Oh no, Peck said. The recipe says to heat oil in a frying pan next. We'll have to ask my dad for help, Olo replied. So they ran to find Olo's dad so they could keep cooking. While Olo's dad was frying up the French toast, Olo and Peck looked for some fruit. They found raspberries, tangerines, pineapple, and ruby red grapefruit. This is going to be fantastic, Peck exclaimed. It felt like forever, but finally the French toast was ready. Olo and Peck had four slices along with a rainbow of fruits. This is delicious, Peck said, and it looks pretty too, Olo realized. After breakfast, Olo and Peck were feeling full and happy. Do you want to find a recipe to make for lunch? Olo asked. So we can fix up another tasty meal? replied Peck. Count me in! <laughs>